LEGO City used to be one of the best LEGO things, but over the years it fell back, focusing too much on fire police and rescue, and time and time again it seems as if LEGO City lost creativity. But that has changed, LEGO City has gotten better. LEGO just revealed the new summer 2023 sets for LEGO City, and some of these are awesome, except first, new LEGO Ocean Exploration sets, and all of these are great except this one. First off, we have a lot of of cool undersea creatures, turtles, and what looks to be a seal, and yes, a baby seal. Also the shipwreck looks awesome, however, this set is not the best I think, it costs 150 euros, which is too much in my opinion, and while it has a killer whale, it doesn't justify the price. Another set I personally don't like is the construction vehicles and wrecking ball crane, I mean, look at this vehicle. Of course, this is a set meant for a younger audience but still for this price no. First is this set, Family House. This set looks like something from 2010. In a good way, it has a greenhouse and this puppy. The color scheme is also awesome. Unfortunately, it costs 52 euros. Will you be buying this set? Let me know. Next is the Ski and Climbing Center. This is a sports fan dream. You can ski, climb all in this artificial space. Reminds me of the American Dream Mall. Look at all these cool white pieces. The minifigure selection is also so good. For some reason, this guy is using a motorcycle here. Next is apartment. Yes, it is pluralized. This apartment building features a commercial space on the first floor, bike space, the other floors feature some apartments of course. This is more of what I want LEGO City to be. There's so much cool detail and color schemes here guys. Next is the skate park with awesome minifigures and accessories. Unfortunately, it costs 55 euros, so I won't be buying this this one. Next is one of the best sets of the theme in over 5 years. Lego Ice Cream Shop. No, it's not a truck, it's a proper building guys. Look at this polar bear. And also there is this super cool ice cream on top, which is melting away. There is also a car wash. Not that interesting, but for 20 euros it is okay, we need more of these cheaper sets. Now I saved the best for last, why? Because this is the new Lego City set, Urban Sator with 2000 the pieces. When I saw this, my mind was blown. So, let's take a look. We have a hair saloon with a veterinary on top. There is also a terrace on top. The coolest part is this pedestrian bridge that is covered, while the other side is even more awesome, featuring a hotel powered by turbines, and of course, a pizza place. Now would be a great time to click that subscribe button. There is also this epic poster on top. The minifigures feature some pretty cool stuff, like this raccoon shirt and many more details. The amount of detail in this set is awesome. The architecture is also pretty cool and we have some pretty interesting color schemes. For years, LEGO City became the same. You knew what to expect. LEGO City became boring. boring. Last year, we got a few cool sets like the trains, but those were expected as LEGO City released LEGO trains every few years or so. Getting awesome sets like the apartments and the house prove that LEGO City can still be a great theme, even when they shine away from fire or police, which are their main butter, of course. However, while this set is awesome and I'm absolutely thinking of getting it, there is one problem, the price. 210 euros, yikes. Almost the price of a modular, that is the problem with this set. Why get this set when for a few more euros you could get the LEGO Jazz Club? This set is targeted at kids older than 8. What father or mother is going to buy this set for their kids? At this price, it's better to just buy food, you know, because you actually need food to survive. This could seriously harm this set. Imagine if only AFOs buy this, and this can become a great problem. After years of doing the same, LEGO is finally giving a chance at something different for LEGO City. But what happens if these new sets fail and don't sell well? Simply, LEGO will go back to what worked. So do you think LEGO City is back to its glory days? When we had sets like this house and this awesome pizzeria? Well, let me know in the comments below. Also, will you be buying these sets? But if LEGO City is this good, just take a look at what LEGO Friends is doing. A botanical garden, yes, LEGO is doing a crystal palace and this is beautiful. I mean, look at the detail on the windows and these super cool dome pieces, which I'm going to be using for mocks, of course. 
I think. Also, look at this tree trunk piece, which seems to be newer. There's also this sports center, which is cool, however, I won't be buying this one. Except that the best set is Heart Lake City Community Center. Each apartment features different colors, which can look a bit ugly. There's also this cool mural that is being painted. There's a greenhouse, a tree, and a slide, of course. So, are you going to get this set? Well, let me know in the comments below. And also, what do you think of the overall design of this set? I also find it cool that the windows of this set change every four, which is something that is interesting. The last set I want to shout out comes from Harry Potter and is the Hogwarts Express. As you know, I like trains quite a lot. So, when I heard the news that LEGO will be releasing a Hogwarts Express with a station, that's just great. The new train looks really cool, however, the coaches look a bit too small. It is great seeing LEGO doing new trains. And if you want to see something that's great, like making YouTubers with LEGO, well, click this video on the screen right now.